guys this is evil gamer g so as you can see i have a grandfather clock with me this has been here for like two years by now it is still brand new it's new working it shines really nice but it it is not west minister as you can see it's not west minister it's just like strike and that's all so it has some nice time shorts in it so <clears throat> excuse me so as you can see it won't stay running so it is a big problem because i really like this grandfather clock it's stylish it's nice so <clears throat> when i put the pendulum in it won't stay running for a while so it's it runs for like five seconds and then it stops at some point so that's where it get annoying so i don't have my flashlight because the battery is a little low in this phone it's actually a samsung galaxy s20 so as you can see it's running without the pendulum so if you listen to this it's running so when i put like a little weight like this thing is from the clock from the other side so if i put this in um it won't stay running also this is a really lightweight thing so the pendulum is a little heavy because it came with it and it's still the old original one so i'm gonna plug put this thing hang it with the pendulum thingy let me pause okay now i have put the thingy in here now if i gave it a little push it won't stay running so this is a really light built thingy made of like metal or something it is not metal it is some kind of strange material so as you can see it's it starts running for a while but as you can see it's running so if i put the proper pendulum in it won't stay running so as you can see it's running real slow but the timer is going a little faster but um, I really need to put the pendulum in because it looks nice in the grandfather clock. It's it, this thing just sucks. You you can't put a, this kind of thing in the the clock. It just looks ugly. And as you can see, it stops. It was running fine, and then it stops. I need to give it a little push or a bigger one. It just won't stay running. So. This clock was gifted by a friend from my dad, but um, this thing is gorgeous. I mean, like, look at this, it's golden. So, these things are made out of metal. And where's the thingy to wind up? The winding key, I think it's on the top of the clock. So, I have winded it a couple of times, but it won't stay running. So, let's back up the time. I read the manual, but there's nothing uh, telling not to move the clock backwards, so there's no warning. As you can see, I can't move it forward. It gets stuck. So, if I put it here, this is a chime one, so it's also locked. I can't go forward, so. As you can see, it's at full wind, but it won't stay running. It it It's sad, I mean, like. This is a gorgeous clock, but as you can see, it's a little bit dirty because it has been in here for like two years by now. It's gorgeous, to be honest. So, this is detachable. So, let me know in the comments if what model this is. Um, if you have this model, so it's just two chime rods heading the chime thing. So, uh, I'm going to do another sound test over here. And clock TV, if you hear, there's another problem here. The chime, uh, the clock chimes after one minute goes on. So, as you can see, it won't chime right there. So, the clock has to chime right there. So, I think this is a really budget clock. That's why it is not chiming at the correct time. I really like your, uh, that colonial style clock. It is pretty nice. So, it chimes right there. So it's just one minute past and then it chimes. So please tell me how to fix it or do I need to put it in the workshop? So yeah, thanks.